gonna wave. You gotta wave. Eric, you gotta wave, man. We're live. Eric, that's not the microphone for the. Uh, we're, live. we're live, guys. The camera is right here. We're live uh, we on the movie live vault. from uh, Los Angeles, California. Uh, you're with me, Chrissy Brzezek, the one streaming. I'm Justin Page. And I'm Eric Garcia, <laughs> and we're doing a, an episode of the movie vault. And this is a very special episode, guys. Oh, yeah. This is a big special episode. Um, you might notice that there's there's someone missing. Pedro, he said he was going to be here. Yeah. We don't know where he is right now, but maybe he might show up on the way. Um, Probably not. But we're going to we're gonna start without him. Yeah. Also, Anthony was supposed to be here. Um, and he is also MIA. We don't know where he yeah, is. We don't here. know where he is. Yeah, but uh, we scheduled a Movie Vault podcast for today, a very <laughs> special one. And the three people you see here are the three people who care most about it. So yeah. let's do it. <laughs> We yeah. are the most pat. We yeah. have most passion. I think that's. I, I don't think a truer statement has been said ever. Yeah. Today. Today, yeah. Mm-hmm. About about us. Yeah. And and that's true. And that's yeah. that's what it's about, you guys. But today is a special episode because mm-hmm. a year ago today, we did the movie vault, the first annual movie vault fall movie look ahead. Are you serious? Yeah. <laughs> September third. September third. What? Yeah. You didn't tell me this. Well, you wanted to true. surprise me. I wanted to surprise you guys. That's really I really nice, thought man. you guys were a little bit closer. Well, emotionally. I... <laughs> okay, continuing. It's a movie Continue vault. Uh, <laughs> it's a movie vault. It's a movie vault. Mo- 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 it is a movie vault. <clears throat> it's the vault movie look yeah. ahead, and we do it every year. And this is the second one because I get the most excited. I mean, yeah. I like summer movies. We do the summer movies special. Oh, yeah. But, yeah. but you really get the most excited about the fall the preview. Fall movies are when the. Not just action, action fair. Leaves are falling. Mm-hmm. The leaves are falling. It gets getting colder. It gets a little bit colder. You gotta wear a sweater. Sweaters. Tax season is is not really f- close. Tax season. Not even on quarterly the mind. quarterly tax season is coming Quarters. up. Not on the mind. Mind. But what is on the mind is good movies. Movies. Horror movies. Good movies. Horror movies. We're talking about Christmas movies. We're yeah. talking about dramatic Oscar bait movies. Mm-hmm. Oscar bait. The ones that we like the most. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Comedies and action movies are fun, but we're really more about the art of the filmmaking Film. and, and analyzing you know, these types of films. And that's why people give us, you know, we have connections and people are giving us these early screenings. They're giving us early screening. Parker. They're giving us early well, screenings. Okay, you know what? Stop. Are you, are you following along with people that are commenting or, or like, okay? No, I was just, I'm not going to be distracted. Who's Parker? He's my friend. Okay. Parker? Parker Posey? Do not, con- I'm not, this isn't on you, this is on Parker, okay? Parker, <laughs> do not comment, okay? We're focusing right now on, on my this. Bad. Is, my bad. Okay. I'm going to no, I don't want, it's not I your fault. I really effed up. It's not up. your fault. I really effed up. Parker, this is to you, man. Do not distract us, okay? <laughs> just watch and enjoy, Okay. Cause I, I want. I was on a good run. You were, dude. I you felt were. Like I was on a really good run. I think I don't think I've ever heard you be that on fi- like 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 on it, you know. And then uh, if you want to kick me out, it's that was fine. It's fire. not on you. I'll leave That's the, the house that I am you. renting from. It's not you. It's Par- It's Parker. I'm sorry. I don't know Parker, but it sounds like a pretty <laughs> He's cool. He's a beautiful, name. beautiful man. Hey yeah. Parker, we don't know you, but I mean, just respect our process. All right, he's my friend, so I'll That's just. That's all I'm gonna say is yeah. that. Okay, great. I don't know him. We so. don't know you, but maybe you're a cool guy, but, you know, right now it's not showing. Yeah. Okay. Parker, uh, I love you. Can we, can, we get, can we get into the movies right away, bud? I would, I would love yeah. to, dude, because this is what I'm all about, right? So what I was saying earlier is that people are giving us screeners and we're seeing these early movies. And what our job is, or what our mission basically is, is where we're going to review them, we're going to play some scenes, and we're going to let you know what you're in, what you're in for. Yeah. Oh, that yeah. you're in for a great movie and hopefully you'll go see it when it comes out. Mm-hmm. We've already seen them, but we want you to see them. Yeah. Spend a lot of time we sitting these with these movies, movies to make bank. Yeah. We have special privileges as critics, you know. Yeah, and so and we, we get yeah. we get the inside scoop and we get to see this these movies way before. We want them to um, touch your lives. And uh, so we want to let you know that like, you know, but the movies that we're going to show you tonight, they're really good. Oh my gosh. These the are best. some these are our top our top yeah. movies coming out in the fall cuz we've seen a lot of them. But we can't. Obviously, we can't play yeah. all of them. We're gonna play our top, our top movies that we're Favorite. most mm-hmm. excited for, and yeah. we've all agreed on this um, before we even started. We made a list, and yeah, we're here. 
We're here to do it. So, the first movie that's coming out, it's coming out soon, guys. It's a September movie release. Uh-huh. Starring my favorite and yours, Antonio Banderas. Wow, love oh, him. He's he is movie. a dreamy steamy. He is. Yeah. yeah. Still, after all these years. Decades. We saw him in Desperado. Ageless. Yeah. Long time ago, and now he's back. Yep. I love him. Puss in Boots. He was the Mask of Zorro. <laughs> he was in Puss in Boots. It's a great Um, a Lest great we forget about Shrek, the origin of Puss in Boots. Very nice. Oh, yeah. Very good call. Yes. Call, uh, call back to that. Mm-hmm. Now Not a this, call back, just a reference just to a, it. <laughs> just a reference, yeah. We, well, never a talk, we didn't even that talk about it before. Nope. <laughs> Stupid. I'm an idiot. It's okay. Don't so, beat yourself up, man. So this movie stars Antonio Banderas. Um, as the lead, his name is Turk Henry. Um, uh, we, we got a romantic love interest, Olga Kurilenko. Yeah. Oh, mm-hmm. yeah. She's amazing. Uh, and then a, a bunch of favorites, mm. guys. Ben mm. Kira, Mark Valley. Mm-hmm. I love. I love Mark Valley. He he's so good in whatever he does. He's David great. Mitchell, Jeremy Swift. Oh, I mean, Swift. Just, uh, a really a cast of favorites, guys. Mm-hmm. And I'm gonna read the synopsis. Just so everyone and has the, a... uh, uh, just because I, I don't uh, don't think our listeners heard the title of the movie is Gun Shy, Thank coming you. out September eighth. Gun Shy, Antonio Banderas. Uh-huh. Remember that, okay? Got it. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, yeah. I know. I saw it. I know. I'm telling them to remember. It. Oh yeah, audience. Yes. Yeah. Um, and so here's the synopsis. Okay. Um, the story follows Turk Henry, Antonio Banderas, a makeup platinum rock star who's married a supermodel, Olga. Krilenko. Okay. So good. So good. So good. <laughs> He's rich beyond his wildest dreams. Whilst on holiday, his wife is mysteriously abducted by a group of renegade shipless pirates. With a little assistance from the local authorities, Turk is forced to embark on a mission to rescue his wife. Mm-hmm. With life skills better suited to playing bass, playing the field, and partying, he's forced to navigate through the deadly jungles and take on a ruthless bandit. <sighs> In his truly hilarious action pack romp. Guys, this is just bringing back how fucking amazing the movie was. Yeah. So like, good. just hearing well, about because that. Because it's yeah. like a detective, like murder, what's yeah. going on? Yeah, you know, yeah, Jacques yeah. Clouse. Jacques Clouse. Clouseau. Clouseau. Yeah, yeah, yeah not yeah. Clouseau. Um, but then also, like, the hilarious romp part, yeah. it's like action comedy. A little Jacques Cousteau, too, Pirates. Pirates, so a little bit of both. Shipless, yeah. no ships. Shipless at pirates. All. Shipless pirates. <sighs> Didn't yeah. think that they had the kind of dignity mm-hmm. that you think would come with re- ship yeah. pirates. No, no, no. Of and I mean, not. I mean, if you didn't even see this movie and you heard about like the synopsis and you heard the main character, like who's the first person you think of? Antonio Banderas, Antonio Banderas to play this right, part, right? right. right. That's the first person you think you of. You wouldn't right? think of anyone else. No one else. No, that's it. He I mean, is the yeah. top build cast yeah. member. And and you yeah. we haven't seen a lot of Antonio Banderas, but that's only because he picks his projects. Mm-hmm. So he's so busy yeah. with his projects. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. He doesn't pick anything that he thinks that he he thinks is beneath him. And that's why I'm so excited about this movie to come out. Yeah. You want to jump right into it? Let's get it. I mean, do you guys have a favorite yeah. scene you want to see? Um, well, I would like to do you want to do you have a favorite scene you want to, you want to see or um, I think it, we have the same favorite yeah, it's, scene. I think yeah. yeah, we had like the same reaction when yeah. we were watching yeah, it. So yeah. let's just uh, should we roll the clip? Yeah, it's at um, he's getting his car fix and yeah. he is uh, eating burrito a burrito and uh, and this is and, before his wife is abducted. Right, right, this right. This is right, like right, right before it's right. like yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, cool, cool. Yeah, cool, yeah. Cool. yeah. Okay, uh, you ready to do it? Yeah. Here we go. All right, I'm gonna play it. Excuse me, sir. Yes. Uh, I'm ready to change the oil on your Ford Taurus. Hey, get it. Come on. Just get it ready already. I'm eating this burrito. Come on, I'm the giant star of the world. You have to do it for me now. Sir, um, I can't accept any payment if it's covered in salsa verde. Well, my salsa verde payment is the only payment you're going to get. Sir, I know that you're the biggest star in all of... America yes. and Europe yes. and the Asias yes. oh and God, Australia and really? the Mongolias and the Mongolias and all of the islands in the, in the South Pacific. Oh kind God, of island. Hold on one second. Hello, how are you doing? Dirk Henry, we love you so much. Dirk Henry loves that you love him. Sir, can you sign? Can you sign my T-shirt? Can I sign it with my Salsa Verde? Uh, 
Of course. Okay, hold on one second. Oh my, oh my god, is that Turk Henry and it's a Jiffy Lube? Hello. What are you hey, doing here? Oh Natalie, my, my favorite fan. Oh my god, I saw that you posted on Instagram that you're going to a Jiffy Lube, and I was like, I also go to Jiffy Lube. I need to see Turk. That's why I tagged you in the photographs so oh you could come god. meet me here. Ah, <laughs> hey, come on, where's my fucking Taurus? Is it ready yet? Hey, I gotta only, get out of here. There's only Jiffy Lube on this island, man. It's hey, man, Jiffy this we island, cars I, over here. I funded this Jiffy Lube with my own money, okay? <laughs> hey, what the fuck do you want? If you ever want to see your wife again, throw out that effing burrito, man. Hold on, it's in the same hand as my phone. Hold on, I had to get it out. Put this also right down. Hey, did you tell him to get rid of the burrito? Yeah, I said get rid of the burrito. He did. Okay. okay, I took it out. Now, who is this, and how do you have my wife? Uh, is your refrigerator running? Jess. Don't do that stupid joke, man. Don't do stop. that. Stop, stop, Miguel. Let me do it. Tell him we hey. got the we, hey. we got his wife. Shut up. Let me try it. I'm trying out to get my type five. Hey, is your refrigerator running? That's so stupid. Uh, yeah, just say yeah, yes, just it say, yes, it is. Did it, we got your wife, man. You get her. Go catch her. I'm gonna kill your wait, wife. Wait, wait, I'm gonna wait. kill your wife if you don't if you don't come and give What's the money. refrigerator thing? I'm so confused. That has nothing to do with it. I don't know why he said it. Dude, well, shut up. You don't have any proof. I don't even know who you are, and I don't even know if you have my wife. Turk I don't Henry. believe you. I am Turk Henry. I am the biggest star in the world. That's why we have your wife. We want your money. We want your money. Who, Turk, we want your money. How, how do I know that you're not just prank calling me and this is a joke? Put, Put his wife on the phone. Put her on the phone. Okay, one second, one second. Tack! Oh my god. Tack! They my have beautiful me. wife. Tack! Oh my god. Ow! They're making me brush my hair. No, you hate brushing your hair. I know. You hate doing that. I like no. to go natural. <laughs> Turk. Who are you? Who are you people? Who? How did I get you? Who are they? Give me the phone. Give me the phone. Okay, here, take the phone. Take it. Turk and how do you have my wife? And don't comb her hair. She hates that. We comb her hair all day. And do you come and give us some No, money? she loves the split ends. She loves it so much. That is her thing, man. Listen. Who are you, man? What you what you do? You stand want to for? know who we are? Yes. We are your worst nightmare, Dirk Henry. We are okay. your worst nightmare. And will you give us a hundred million dollars? We will not give yo, your uh, wife. Yo, Miguel, it's uh uh seven billion. Seven billion. billion dollars. Yeah, no, hundred million. That's not a lot. Is he worth out seven billion dollars? Doug Henry, you worth seven billion dollars? No, that's not how much money I have. Try six bill. Are you anywhere near billions, Jace? Oh, you are. Yes. Ask him if he's between two and five billion. Okay. Uh, are you in between two and five billion, maybe? Yes, I am. Oh, okay, great. Okay. Yeah, go for uh, three. Go for uh, three. Well, it, he says he's up to five billion. Why not five billion? Yeah. I don't know. Just you want to negotiate. It's like basic negotiating skills. Well, I'm gonna go for the biggest number I can. All right. I'm gonna go for the biggest number. Hey, Turk Henry, can you give yes. us, um, I, I don't know, like five billion for your wife? I don't have any money then. Well, yeah. I mean, how much is your wife worth to you? I really have to think about this. Turk Henry has a lot to think about. Well, we're gonna fucking kill you. Can wife. I call you back? Uh. Yeah, you have five minutes. I guess yeah. That's not a lot of time. Five minutes. <laughs> oh, so sir, uh, your muffler is back on your car. Uh, are you crying? No, Turk Henry does not cry. So Only tired. tears of happiness, because my new album is platinum gold, and that is why I'm crying. What's your album called? It's called Turkey Turkey. It's the Turk Day. You do music? Yes, I do. Of course I do. Do not know who I am. I'm Turk Henry. Oh my God, he's Turk Henry. Oh yeah, I'm Turk Henry. These are my fans that came with me to the Turk room. Henry. Yes, this is my favorite fan, and I I really need to get out of here. Can you please give me my four chorus? Yeah, here's the keys, man. Thank you very much. 
You guys, that was... Wow. wow. I mean, the intricacies of that Jesus. scene were incredible. Oh, my God, because that's just the beginning. The build-up yeah. is, like, so much... And you, you really see what he's going through. Because mm -hmm. Antonio Banderas has the... Oh, my God, just his... You can see it in his face. Yeah. Like, he doesn't say a lot, but he's showing the struggle that he's going through with his wife. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And, like, the, these guys, um, you know, the guys who kidnapped his wife, they're... They seem like they're inept, but their plan is devious absolutely i also think it's cool slash interesting that yeah. uh his character is like i'm the most famous person in yeah. the world he's like so, he knows yeah. it in, like in in that moment he knows that yeah. he is the yeah. most famous person in the world yeah because in this not movie, afraid to say it yeah he's playing like someone on the level of like a vin diesel or you yeah. know someone on the level of like um mark uh, a baby McGrath. or yeah. something or mark mcgrath yeah all those, yeah. I agree Just with someone both that of you guys. Big. See, kind of like a uh, lead singer of Smash Mouth, I feel like. Right, yeah. um, Because well, he has an album out. Like, yeah. It's so cool. He's a singer in addition to being an actor. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Well, he's a rock star. Yeah. Well, that's why I said Vin yeah. Diesel, because Vin Diesel yeah. also sings. He does? He does. Yeah, he has Vin a Diesel lot of songs and covers that he uh, that he puts out on can his you, Facebook. Can, uh, can you like sing a little bit of a song that he's done? One of his songs? One yeah. of his cover songs? Yeah. No, just uh, he does songs. He covers songs. Can you do a cover of a Vin Diesel song? I actually have a recording of it. A oh. recording of Vin yeah, Diesel. Yeah, let's just oh, play an yeah, actual yeah, yeah, yeah. recording. Why don't yeah, yeah, yeah. Have to, yeah. Can it's, we have it's, to? It's, do yeah, it's just a of part it. of a song. So, uh, um, so it's his. Uh, uh, it's a it's a cover of uh, of another song, of a popular song, and I just have a small clip of it. So I'll just play it right okay, now. Thank okay. you. Wake me up inside Save me, save me from Nothing I've become Diesel Yeah, that's um, Evanescence, yeah. right? That's Yeah, that yeah. is Evanescence. Yeah. Evanescence 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 But do you see what I'm saying? Is like, he's a great actor But then we also find out he's a great singer Really yeah. good at acapella yeah. Well, yeah, and that's Just what oh, there's that's no the music tones. in it. That's why it's connected yeah. to so it's much really with nice. what Antonio Banderas is doing. Yeah, he's, he's just like a salt of the level. earth kind of guy. You know, I feel like I can really trust him. Yeah, you know? he's really great. I mean, look at like Jared Leto, right? Look at Justin Timberlake. All these guys that just have like all these. Guys I mean, you, we we got an international superstar in our hands, guys. You know, like like he's got he's he's got a, an album. You know, every celebrity has an album. Yeah. Right? And that I mean, this movie's on. coming out soon. Yeah. September eighth. Yeah. September eighth. And like, that's why I'm excited. Weekend. Yeah, this weekend yeah. it's coming out. I really like that he, you know, like he he posts he's going to Jiffy Lube on Instagram, like he's got all this hubris, like yeah, he's like, I'm going I to identify Jiffy Lube. with that. Yeah, totally. Yeah. yeah, I get it. Um, what I thought was really awesome is that crazy monologue he gives at the top of uh, an auto heap, like a the pile of Volkswagens in that junkyard. Oh my gosh, I when love that scene yeah, so much. Yeah, when he's much. trying yeah. to, um, it's like last ditch effort to try mm -hmm. and find his wife and he just can't find her. When he gives it like really amazing, epic, heartwarming monologue. Mm -hmm. Yeah, oh my God. Can we see that scene? You yeah, guys want to like see it. that? Yeah. I have it queued up right here. Great, okay. Ready, set, go. Hello everyone. I gather everyone on this pile of Volkswagens to talk to you about my wife. I miss her so much. Hey, Turk Henry. Yes. You, you're really doing it, man. Thank you. Thank you, Antonio. You're my favorite friend and fan. Hey, thumbs up to you. Thank you for thumbs up. Hey, Dirk. Yes. It's me, Antonio S. I just want to say I really like the work that you are doing. Thank you, thank you. Now if we could transfer the energy into the admiration for me and my work to finding my wife in these land pirates that <laughs> took them. His wife is busy. This wife is amazing. Thank you, Antonio. Spread the word. Oh my god, that's so sad. His wife? What? His wife is That's really sad. Everyone, spread the word about my wife. She is missing. And I can't... I'm not gonna lie to you right now. Can I be honest? Yeah. Hey. hey. Yeah, man. You hey, Dirk, give us a rousing speech. Give okay. us a rousing speech and inspire us to find your wife. So yeah, like... I am like really haven't done this anything like with my life lately and I'm just looking for some kind of motivation. That is why I brought you all here today on top of these Volkswagens to talk to you about my wife. I have to admit something because I owe five billion dollars to these guys and I lied to them saying I was worth five billion 
because I'm not, and I owe so many taxes. <gasps> so I forgot, like no one told me that you had to owe taxes. I thought that once you get to a certain like level that you can't have to pay them, right? Right. Turk Henry, Turk Henry doesn't have to pay taxes, right? Hey, That's what I thought. To pay taxes, man. Hey, I fucking didn't know that. Okay, so like, <clears throat> I'm really upset at myself more than anything because it's my wife and she's so beautiful and she's so smart. She's the smartest woman I've ever met in my life. Turk Henry, it sounds like you care more about your money than your wife. No, no, no. I'm talking about my mistakes you with care my money. About more money than your wife. Who is this fucking piece of shit, man? Hey, who are you? Turk Henry's Antonio, the best. Antonio. Hey, man. You really want to help Turk Henry out? Yeah. Fucking hurt this guy, man. Hey, I got a wrench right here. Hey, no. No, please. Hey, I come have here, a family. you piece of shit. No, I haven't seen Turk Henry. That's right. That's right. That's right. right. Oh, oh, God. Turk Henry's the fucking best. Okay. Thank you, Antonio. Hey. You are loyal to me. Proceed, Mr. So, Henry. So, anyways... I was wondering if anyone had like a little extra chump change and you could put some money together to get my wife back. I owe like a lot of money to the IRS and it's it's not good and I should have just told them how much money I had. Hey Dirk Henry, I have 15 pesos. That's enough, like just that, that'll be okay. Just put it in the, in the pile, put it in the glove box of the Volkswagen. Hey everybody, everybody. Yeah, yeah. What? Yeah. What? Everyone knows there's change inside the seats of these cars. Everybody, it's our mission to help Turk Henry. We have to go inside and find yes. as much as change as we can. Thank you so much, everyone. <laughs> it makes me so happy. All right, guys. So, what's this meeting about? Antonio. God, I got out of bed for this. Antonio. Antonio was a spy. At this big meeting. Yeah, I was wondering where that meant. For Turk Henry. And he was talking about what happened. Just tell them what happened, man. Tell us what happened. Yeah, I'm really interested. Okay, well, here, check this out. Okay. Turk Henry, is, he has, he owes a lot of taxes. He doesn't have five what billion. What the fuck? He has not five billion. He has less than that, like one billion. Oh! But how much money does he have? I, I, I don't know. He's... He says he's cash poor. This is bullshit, man. He's cash poor right now. He's very famous, but he has zero money. Maybe he should think about getting an investment banker and like having some kind of stock portfolio. I tried to tell that to him, but he doesn't know what this means. There's this really awesome app called Acorns that it's linked to your bank account and whatever you spend, it rounds up to the next dollar and puts that into your investment. And it invested in, in night and good things that are on the up and coming things. Karen, thank you for coming here and talking about your apps again. It's so like helpful to us because like we don't know about this stuff. Like we hang out in like alleyways and like caves and stuff and like you're like out there you have a real job and like I will go really to helps. any cave to I educate actually, you guys about I apps. used air coins and it, 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 it's already starting to earn me money. See? <gasps> Felipe so always funny. uses it. He's always the one using your apps first. Hey, Felipe, man. You're, hey, you're doing good. You're doing good, Felipe. Felipe, I'm so proud of you. Yeah, okay. okay. So it's, uh, but back to the matter at hand. So, what? How can we get the most money out of this fucking Turk Henry? He's a piece of shit. He wrote a song about my mother. <gasps> yeah. Wait, how did it go? It's... Do hey, you want to hear it? You have to sing it. I don't want to. Sing. You have to sing it. Sing it. Okay, sing it I'll, fast. I'll sing it, Carrie. Sing it. I don't think okay, you get okay. it. I want to. It goes like this. He said, he said, uh, he called me. He said, Mio, you are stupid because I fucked your mom. <gasps> and I will do it over and over again. That piece of shit. And he did it in like a fast mariachi music thing. And I can't repeat it, but... Yeah. He also said that like next time I do it, I'm gonna make you watch. I know that song. That was on the chart. That top the charts. It was. It was on the top charts. Okay. Shut the fuck up. Okay, it's like a horrible song. I don't know how it got up there because it's, it's like really it's like so disgusting. Catchy. Fuck you, man. It's so, so catchy. I'm sorry. It's catchy. It's, okay, it's a little catchy. Like it sounds. He writes good. songs like Taylor Swift. They're so catchy. They stick in your head. Okay. 
Can we like not talk about how that song is good for you guys? It was stuck in my head for a while. Just that's what Brian reminded me of. It's a really catchy song. See, even even Raul thinks it's it's catchy. It's very catchy. Ra Raul loves pop music. Okay. I love pop music. I think it is so beautiful. I love the T Swift. Raul, you need to stop being so sexual when you talk about songs, okay? It's what? like really weird. Oh, yeah. I love the Earth, Wind and Fire. It is so sensual. Did you say Ass, Wind and Fire? Ass, Wind. That is what we call fart in France. Raul's French, man. I, I didn't know So anything. French. Sometimes you people who live here mix up any kind of European bars. It makes you look very stupid. Okay, guys, we need to like get together here. Despite how much we argue, we are a very diverse group. This us land pirates. You know what I'm saying, guys? I love this. I like that about us. I like love good. being a land pirate because I can just like, I get really seasick. I can't believe Stephanie, you know? that's why we started this thing, okay? Seriously, like I love you guys. Stephanie, yeah, we I, love you I too. Swear to God. We really love you too. You I guys? love this group. Like, I came here to see Turk Henry, but then I found you guys, and I just feel like I'm at home right now. I'm Paul, so comfortable. Paul, Paul, the gay man. He is so cool. Like, everyone here, like, I say, I said, bring everyone you want, and then they came to my land pirate meeting, and now we are, like, we are stealing from people, we are, like, doing all these things, and we're making money. I love scalping humans. You love that, Stephanie. That's really weird. And it's like, you need to like tone it down a little bit. I'm a pirate. Okay. You are a pirate. You're a land pirate. You are one of us now. I'm a land pirate. I'm, I'm a land pirate too. Pepito, you, guys... you are the land pirate of all land pirates. I just started here, but I, I believe you guys are my family now. Yeah. Well, we're going to get this motherfucker, okay? Because... Let's fucking kill him. Get him! All right, wow, that was wow. that was a long scene. So that went on for another hour. Yeah, it goes yeah. on for a while. I mean, we yeah. find a lot about the land pirates, which is important. Yeah. It's I will, really important I will say that's story. important. Just say it comes back later. It does. Oh, yeah. It comes back In later. In a big, bad way, mm -hmm. you guys. But it also makes you feel for the land pirates. Mm -hmm. Like you, They're the antagonists, but when you watch it, you're... You don't know whose side you're on. No. Well, it's crazy because you think about villains. I yeah. mean, they're more than just evil people. They are real people, real humans, yeah, like real whatever goals, kind yeah. of shape, you know, a villain takes. Like, yeah. they have feelings. And these land pirates and are, relationships. are all inclusive. Oh, know? yeah. They're, I mean, they're not, no one is rejected from their group. Right. Whereas Turk Henry is very uh, isolated. He's his, isolating. His speech was riveting. His speech Honestly. was great. Top of those Volkswagens. Yeah. He kept talking about them and he... It's just more like a plead for help. Yeah. Yeah, but a beautiful plea. Oh, Here's yeah. what I love though. This movie turns into... It's about the land pirates being the good guys. That's really what it's and about. And then Turk Henry being the fucking bad guy that he is and being revealed as not a hero and not a rock star. Yeah, and and not, a, not, not a... Yeah, he Here's is, what he happened is a bad is, guy. Is the, I think the moral is that... Fame makes you a bad person. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, it is. Ooh. And super fame makes you a super bad person. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. I think there's correlations with real life here. It really is. And that, I think that this is why I, I will expect this to get an Oscar nod. Yeah. And Truly. Yeah, I, I believe I believe it will get mm -hmm. an Oscar nod. It's a nod and for I, me. I'm going to put, yeah. Yeah. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say that it will get an Oscar nod for Best Picture and it probably will win. Yeah. And you can take that to the bank. You can take that to the bank. Take guys. it to the bank. You don't say that about every movie, too. When you say when you say an Oscar nod and then you say take I take that to the bank, then I, it's it's a serious it's nomination. It's a signature phrase. Yeah. It's a lock. Yeah, I say yeah. I save it for very rare movies that yeah. I feel mm -hmm. are beyond um, beyond the caliber mm -hmm. that you would expect. Yeah, and just the camaraderie with the land pirates, oh right? Gosh, yeah. You get Karen the app so developer. So supportive. We got Stephanie. You know, all socioeconomic Pepito. classes. Yeah. Pepito's probably one of my favorite little guys. Oh, God. Can we talk about Raul, though? He Raul really is a sex a machine. Yeah. It's like a European oh, yeah. sex vibe. Like brings everyone together. Americans yeah. 
are so concerned about mm-hmm. like, sexuality yeah, and yeah, yeah. fucking prudes. Oh my and then God. Raul comes in and he's just like, let me touch just your face. Sexuality. Let me yeah. touch your face. Or however a French accent is. I don't know. Yeah. No, I think, um, mm. I think that, I think you got it. And then I think that the character nailed it too. Yeah. You know, he really, I, I knew it was French. Um, I love that Raul is played by um, Ethan Embry from Can't Hardly Wait. Mm-hmm. That's right. Yeah. That's right. I noticed he's that. Doing a, yeah. He's doing a, some character work in this, yeah. and it's great. It's mm-hmm. really so cool. good, you guys. He's got yeah. so much different facial makeup on yeah. that I didn't even realize it was him yeah. until the end credits when I saw it was his name. That, Yeah. I, Unbelievable. I, when, when, when you when you uh, when you pointed that out to me, I was like, I, yeah. dude, I wouldn't have caught that unless you said something. Yeah, yeah. So I mean, my rating, if I had to give it a rating, I'd say, I'd say fifteen tubs of popcorn. Whoa, dude, that's big. That's my rating. I'm gonna give it uh, six pages of a book. Nice. Yeah. I am gonna give it a seven checkered. Shirts from J. Crew. Oh wow! Great. Yeah. That's a high That's honor. So good. Because they're expensive. Let yeah. me tell you. They're not cheap. So it's a lot of money. Yeah. No. My rating equates to monetary value. I think that's. Mine are leather pages from a leather book. Yeah. So what what do you write on the leather with? Um, a so you sew the words into the pages. Oh, that's smart. Yeah, yeah. That's smart. Yeah. That's crafty. Yeah. It's the thing I'm starting, which is like, it's like leather booking. Oh. Yeah. Where it's like the outside pages are just parchment and oh. then like the outside covers and the inside oh, leather pages. Book. I yeah. feel like and that's then, gonna catch on. I mean, I hope it does. That's my hope, right? I mean, I'm an inventor. I'm an inventor. You guys know that. Yeah, I do yeah, patents. Yeah. And so I what's like, our next yeah. movie? All right. Okay, well, moving on. As much as we love that movie, this movie we love so much more. I make, uh, for... I make books with uh, leather pages in them and I sew them so if you want to go to my That's website great. check out my Facebook. Really yeah. Good. Yeah. Really yeah. Good. yeah, it's, it's a good so idea. I'm so happy for you. It's a good idea. Um, this movie we loved a lot too but for a different reason because it's a different kind of movie. It's not It's not so much Oscar bait like Antonio Banderas' last mm-hmm. movie was mm. but it is a fun movie because it comes out towards the end of September which is the beginning of October which means mm-hmm. Which means what, guys? Halloween. It means the oh, ghosties yeah. and the ghoulies are out. The ghouls are and out. Everybody the is ghosties. ready to be scared. Mm-hmm. Everyone is ready to be. Scared. Everyone is ready to be all spooked up. And how could you get? Uh, how could you get your 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 spooky your spookies in with a with a horror movie? That's how. You, that's how you do that's it. How you do that's it. how. That's exactly how you do it. <laughs> you get it with a horror movie. I love when you ask questions and answer them. Like, how about to answer them? That's what I love about you, man. I want to say that. <laughs> how you say it, too. And so this next movie is coming out towards the... What's it called? Well... He's doing a setup. I'm, I'm, try- I'm trying to set it up here. Um, and you're not really letting me do it. Uh, <laughs> it's, it's a movie that... It's a movie that we, we liked, and it goes back to our childhood. Because oh God. the first two installments came out over... 15 years ago. Mm-hmm. Are you serious? Yeah. The first two install- installments of it came out. And it's finally coming back, you guys, with uh-huh. the third installment. A little movie I like to call Jeepers Creepers 3. Yes. Oh. Yes. And by yes, I mean no. I did not like this movie. You didn't? Oh, I disclosed it. Well, disclosed it. All right. Just, just give the, you know. Do the thing first. I'm going to get the synopsis in. I'm right. very opinionated. So, All right. I'm just going to go ahead. I disagree with you on the on off the bat, Eric. Say, I disagree with you on principle. Yeah, okay. yeah. Um, so that's what's so, you. This is Jeepers Creepers 3. Mm-hmm. It's set between the first and the second film. This is an in-betweener. Okay. It's an in-between cool. Um, Sergeant Davis Tubbs assembles a task force to destroy the Creeper once and for all while growing closer than ever before to learning the secrets of its dark origin as the monster terrorize a local farming community. Now, everyone knows if you have something scary, how do you make it scarier? You tell its origin. Mm-hmm. You tell about how it got right. so scary. Right, everybody yeah. knows that. Yeah. That's how you make things scarier. <clears throat> mm-hmm. And I feel like they've done this so well in this movie mm-hmm. because it is one of the scariest movies, if not the scariest movie that I've ever seen in my life. Mm-hmm. Come on. Scarier than Jeepers Creepers. Scarier than Jeepers Creepers 2. 
because the creeper is so scary and we find out how he became scary and that's a big part of the movie mm-hmm. a big part of the movie is you're seeing the little creeper mm-hmm. turn into the jeeper creeper mm-hmm. yeah who's who's the what's the top build cast bud well this one is also stacked with favorites you guys Ooh. so we got uh galen uh, the character Galen Brandon, played by Meg Foster. Mm-hmm. We mm-hmm. got the character of Trisha Jenner, played by Gina Phillips. We got Jonathan Breck back as Jeeper Creeper. Nice, Jonathan yeah. Breck. Johnny Breck. Brex. Jonathan Brex. Yeah. <laughs> Carrie Lazar as Beth Mathers. Stan Shaw as Sheriff Tashton. And bringing the star power, you guys, we got Dave Davis as SWAT. SWAT team member. Mm-hmm. Of course. I'm glad Dave Dave's in this. Dave Daves. Dave Davis. Davies Davis. I was I was kinda I hadn't seen him for a while, you know. Yeah. Glad yeah, well it. sometimes you don't see him for a while, but I mean he's sometimes making moves, Dave you guys. just kinda falls off the map for a few years and then he comes back when you least expect it. Well here he's got so, the star power. Just kind of a sidebar on Dave Davis. He is He's an artist. He's got a lot of things going on other than acting. Yeah. He's an inventor as well. Yeah. 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 Anyways, we don't have to talk about that. He but. does microbrew. He does, you know, he paints. He, yeah. he does a lot of cool stuff. He does um, scrapbooking. He also cuts his own jigsaw puzzles. I heard he does leather booking. That, that's pretty cool. Yeah, it's not good, but I know that. Well, yeah. I heard but it's really, he's really good I at think it. your leather booking will, is probably... Maybe better than his. Yeah, I would say that too. But um, let, let's just keep going. Be. Yeah, let's just do the movie stuff. Heard. Yeah. All right. Well, I mean, wow. I would like to play one of the. I would like to play one of the scarier scenes. Oh yeah. Yeah, I guess so. Is oh, when yeah. we see. Well, boring. <laughs> yeah. This is when we see the creeper for the first time, mm-hmm. and in it, within it, there's a flashback to a little creeper. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. Whoops. Okay. All right. So let's just play that. Okay. <laughs> It's me, the Creeper. What are you guys doing? Dude, did you hear that? Yeah, that that sounds really funny. What are your kids doing tonight? Who said that, dude? Hey, I'm in the closet. Hope the door let me out. I want to play. Here, I'll do it, man. Don't know what. Are you not? You're scared? No. No, dude, I don't even care. Just, let's just go play video games. Come on. Johnny, Evan, let me out. We're going to just keep playing video games in here, and this thing's going to keep talking to us. I don't hear anything. I'm pretty sure it's one of my sister's friends just being a goof. Your sister's friend, Harmony? Yeah. Dude, she's so hot. Summertime, and the living is easy. Now I hear it. That's definitely Harmony. Dude, is she singing Sublime? I love Sublime. <laughs> Summertime is an original song, not by Sublime. Dude, I love Sublime, and she's singing Sublime right now, and it's so good. You want to go the wrong way. The only money that I ever had was a seven holy brothers and a drunk ass bad. Dude, is that a, that's Harmony, dude. That's my sister's friend, I think. It's your sister's friend. What's she doing in the closet? You guys, let me out. Come on. All right, let me open the door. Harmony? <laughs> oh, oh shit! Because uh, I have this machete, and my boss told me that I'm supposed to hit you with it. I just don't want to. Dude, Harmony looks different, man. Oh god, she's covered in black tar or something. Yes. Yeah. You guys, come on, can we just play or something? I don't know. What happened to you? What are you talking about? You keep changing, like. <laughs> I don't understand. What is so funny? Do I look ugly or something? No, no, you look fine. Hold on. Oh, you know, I was bullied when I was a wee little creeper, and I'm just now coming terms with it. What? I'm coming to terms with it. Creeper? Yeah, what's that? Wait, I remember hearing a story about a jeeper creeper. Is that, is that you? you? Oh, damn, she didn't answer. We'll never know. She disappeared. Hey, Jeeper, come over here. What is it? What did I tell you about leaving your your, your machetes all over our rug? Hey, uh, Lieutenant Tubbs. Hey, man, uh, so, uh, Jimmy's drunk again. 
And he's driving the squad car. God damn it. God damn it. Are you Jimmy. doing something important? I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. But this I'm, is important. Uh, right? Well, I'm just trying to discipline my son Jeeper here. All right. <clears throat> Gee, I've told him to clean up his toys from the rug. And now... Now I'm going to make you clean out the tar vat. Dad, don't make me clean out the tar vat. Did I do something wrong? Yeah, you know exactly what you did wrong. I just told you you didn't clean up the toys from the rug. Now you got to clean up the tar vat. Dad... Can I ask you a question? God damn it, what is it? When is mom coming home? Ah, uh, you know what, it hit me right in the heart. I can answer that, uh, chief. Mom's dead. Uh, she died last summer. Uh, what? Uh? Was I not supposed to say that, chief? Uh, yeah, what? He doesn't know. Wait, what? Oh shit, I'm so uh, sorry, chief. Uh, 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 <laughs> oh, shit. Hey, chief. Can I just give him a two cents here? I think that your son fell in this tar and it's fucking making him, making him weird. Oh yeah, he's all covered in tar. God, God, God damn it, Jeeper. What? I'm sorry. God damn it. I didn't mean to upset you guys. Get over here. Ow. Hey, Chief, Jeep. stop hitting your kid, man. Chief, 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 Oh, god damn it, he's singing Sublime. Summertime, and the curtain is high. Oh, shit. Get off of me, John. Chief. Uh, no, ah, Chief. Chief, no. stop being your kid, man. Chief. Chief, Yay. Chief, Chief, Chief. You gotta stop doing that, man. You, you, <laughs> you know you, what? You represent more than that, Chief. I'm done with this. I'm leaving. I just miss my wife so much. I know, I know. It's hard, it's hard. God, I shouldn't have said that. Don't you ever come back, Jeeper. Oh, God, I'm gonna miss you. You just wait, Chief. Can I just say something right now? Your kid's it's covered in tar, and it's threatening to leave your house and be homeless. I already left him outside. Uh, he, he's not my kid anymore, Chief. I'm gonna have to report. Th I'm sorry. I have to report this. Well, I'm gonna have to fire you from the force. Oh, fuck. Uh. I quit then, man. This is bullshit. Chief, you gotta you gotta get your priorities straight, man. God damn it. Listen, John. dude. We got we got I, I originally came here because Steve's driving the squad car and he's drunk really drunk. He's really fucked up. And he's he's it's not I just don't know what to do to he's him. He's a better driver when he's drunk. That's not a good thing that to, to, you can't You know what, John? What? I've had enough of your shit. You're fired. Okay. And I'm never gonna need your help ever again, so don't ever come back. <laughs> Well, John, I never thought that this day would come, but I do need your help. My boy Jeeper's out there, and he's, he's terrorizing the local kids. You abandoned him 30 years ago. You let him walk out tarred. You don't think I think about that every day? I, I, I was, like, sitting with you, like, working it out, saying, like, are you sure you want to do this? It wasn't just, like, the split decision where no one was around you. Like, you had, you had like, a choice. God damn it, John. You don't think I regret that? I should have done so many things better. I should have stopped. What's his name from driving drunk? I don't even remember. Yeah, he fucking killed like a whole family, man. He I like he got it. he got a family in his squad car and then drove it around and like crashed it. I don't know why I didn't stop that. Yeah, you know, you told him to do it because you were like, you're a great drunk driver. Drive this family home from this like. They were in a fire and they needed to get transported home and they escaped barely and then he was like Steve just take this family home don't, you're yeah, better don't I'm just you can't, you're just, you're you're being over, trying, you're being remorseful I'm trying to apologize to you buddy Okay well check it out You can't stop it I know a guy okay who can he, your son is like a demented like monster okay some spell has been cast on him He's full of voodoo yeah, something like that. God, that's what I'm. That's my guess. Okay, it's something like that. You're right, but it's the voodoo is like a control thing by someone else is controlling their body. But okay, I'm not I, a voodoo historian. I don't know how it works. I know you're not, but I have a guy who can help us. Okay. Hey, my name is Bob. Dude. I'm the Voodoo King. Is there anything I can help? I call. This is Bob the Voodoo King. I okay. call him because he. I call him Bob. Okay, because Bob. Bob has had cases like this where, cause so tar and then a traumatic experience can somewhat summon up demons, okay? And you have to do is you Wait, have to- Wait, did you say tar? 
Yeah. Oh, Fridge, you're talking about tar on a person? Yeah, yeah, we... Yeah, my boy... That bo- is bad. My boy is covered in Voodoo. tar. Voodoo. No, no, no. Tar, you are gonna have a cursed life. Cursed life. Hey, hey, who's Flash Bob? I, I already do. My life's been cursed for years and years now. Oh, oh. I, uh, you're not telling me any new information. You're, I'm you're sorry not, to hear that. You're not forward in the conversation at all. Okay. I didn't have any previous contacts of your history. Well, because I also called somebody. Bob, okay, you called somebody? Yeah, I called a, a SWAT team member. Okay. And he's he's on his way. His name's Terrence. Hey, I'm Terrence. I'm a SWAT guy. God damn it, Terrence. Why don't you knock on the door? I don't knock on doors. I'm SWAT. I enter wherever the hell I, I want. Okay, what what is he going to do about the spell, man? Well, he's... I mean, he's going to stop my son, Jeeper. Okay. Show me a picture. Okay, here's a picture of him. Okay. Oh, he's, he's, he's really ugly. I know, he's really ugly. He's, he's so ugly. I want to punch him in the dick. He also sings Sublime songs all the time. Oh, I love Sublime. They're a really good band. Okay, regardless of how you think of them, God, I... God, so many hits. Hey, yeah. John, John, can I talk to you for a second, man? Okay, hold on one second. Oh, sure, I'm just going to stand right over here. Listen, these two guys that we got, they're... They seem very kind of wacky and whimsical and I, I don't know if they're the right the right choice to look at it, to, to catch my it's, son it's kind of really the only thing we got like we, we, we have to fight fire with fire here man you know we have to try to get magic Are I don't know about the swap talking about fire I got all kinds of fire see Bob here my Toyota Voodoo, Tacoma. Voodoo Bob has a ton of he has a bunch of spells right? you guys want to walk over to my Tacoma Take well, a look on. at my Tacoma and see what's in there. Tubbs, just just trust me on this one, okay? God damn it, Four John. door cab. I got a cab in my Tacoma. John, you're the best you're the best deputy I ever had. I should have never fired you. I'm doing great. I have a really good life that I not work for you now, but that's just I got I have to I had to come back here. John, I did a real bad thing by, by covering my son in tar and sending him out in the anyway, You already expressed your, your remorse for this. Terrence, I, I wanna apologize to you. Yeah. So I want to apologize for what? For letting that horse kick you in the head. I, I just did this. I moved on. It's fine. Yeah, I'm okay. What happened? I I, I, I had him bring in my horses, and, and one of them was getting a little jumpy, and I knew it, but I didn't say anything. Uh, so All right, Terrence. Well, we're gonna get on the horse, buddy. Okay, sounds absolutely wonderful. Oh, very good. Okay, so Terrence is an exchange student from England, and I, I adopted him, and he loves horses. So, Tubbs, Tush Tubbs, we know that your whole force is based, you guys all bred horses, so we really want you to teach him. So, you know, he's, yeah, yeah, he's, yeah, yeah. he's a little spunky guy, so, you know, just be really careful with him and just, you know, okay, so go. I just want to let you know, very, very protective. Cheers, I would absolutely love to learn dressage for horses. It's a certain way that they walk with their hooves. It's just absolutely beautiful. All right, well, uh, uh, I'll see. You, I'll see you in a few hours. I'll, I'll teach you right. everything I know. All right, Terrence, behave, okay? Just, be, just be patient with him, okay? You, la 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 yeah, you're gonna ride this horse Diablo. That's kind of an ominous name for a horse. Your your job here, your job is to tame Diablo, all right? I'm I thought go. I was just riding. Hey, hey. What? Who's talking? What, you? Yeah, I'm talking. You are. That's right. Yeah. Terrence, shut the hell up. Okay. Ah! Ooh! <laughs> excuse, excuse me, that's my son you're hitting. That's my exchange student's son. Oh, mommy. What's wrong with you? Mommy, I'm in so much pain. Hey, hey, listen. Sh- shut the hell up, okay? You don't tell me to shut the hell whoa, up. Whoa, Diablo. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa. Ah. Whoa. Mom. Mom. Oh, God. What are you doing, Mom? Oh, my God. That's horrible. Yeah, that's, that's, that's why. I, see, you're, you're, I'm you're, trying to you're, give you're, him you're I can't completely hear any of y'all right now. I'm trying to give him a job on a SWAT team and bring him in and... He's, he's just out of control. You got a lot to atone for, Tubbs. Atonement. I love beating people. I know. You fuck. 
I know. This is fucked up. I don't know why I came here. Um, okay, can we just get along with it? Where's the scary sun? <laughs> well, that's what we gotta go find. Let's go find him. Wow, that was a great scene. Um, you guys... Great couple of scenes. Yeah. There was a lot going on there. Oh, yeah. That... People really underestimate the father-son relationship. Mm -hmm. so I mean, much. when so I much. think of the word relationship, I think of something positive, but it can also be used to describe something fucked up and twisted. Yep. Oh man, and that's oh, yeah. one thing this movie is. It is. It is. Oh man, it's so dark. Yeah, it's dark. This movie it is. is. It's dark. There's so much subtext. This movie is Dark City. Okay. Mm -hmm. Dark City. Yeah. Dark City. So much. Dark you guys. City. Yeah. Subsidies. Subsidize. No, I said Dark City. Subsidize. No, dark, dark city. Subsidize. Dark All right, guys. Whichever it is, dark city or subsidize, this gets really deep into some relationship stuff, like yeah. father and son. Oh man. I mean, this is really deep, oh, guys. Oh man. Tubbs is a is a real piece of man, shit. Tubbs is. Well, he yeah. and he's our he's our he's our protagonist. Uh -huh. Yeah. Surprisingly. Surprisingly, he's the protagonist. Turn, I mean, you should see the end of this. Uh, I'm just going to say that um, this movie uh, transcends the horror genre for me as oh, a man. third act in the trilogy uh, because um, they do a lot of song and dance stuff and there's a sublime musical sort of theme to reference. it. Reference. It keeps well, coming yeah. Very, yeah. yeah. It's so strange. Um, they don't reference the original like um, sample of the song, but they yeah. just go to the, that's a sublime yeah. song and then... It's very, uh, I, just, I don't know. I like that. I like that they did that. Yeah, I think that was kind of cool, especially for like the 90s kids out there who like really dug Sublime, you know, that Sublime life. Um, yeah. I, I mean, like, you know, a reason why I didn't really like the movie is because they just don't, there's no solution. At, there's no uh, resolution at the end. I'm going to stop you there, okay? Come and on. just say Come that. Please stop her. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I will. Right. Okay. Don't let the and woman talk. It's not what this is about, okay? It's not what this is about. Seems like it is. It's about the fact Sex. that I like... Please okay. stop her. Please okay. stop her. You need to stop that. You need to stop Sex. accusing me of Sex. being that. No, 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 no. Okay, well, we're no, not getting no, no, anywhere no. now. We're no, not getting no, anywhere. No, 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 no. I'm not a baby. I don't talk to you're me You're a little baby. baby man. You're a tiny baby man. I'm not a baby man. You're a tiny baby man. Let's get back on track here, okay? Yeah, sure. No, I'm ready. Woman. Yeah, that's... The uh, gender I identify with. And I identify as a man, and I, as a man, say that this movie does not need to resolve in the end. It needs to keep confusing you into thinking, who is this Tubbs guy? Do I really like him? Do I really want him to win? Yeah. Or do I want him to fail and want his son to kill Ooh, him? Oh, man. I don't know. Right? It's not about morality. It's not no. about good and evil. It's about Why did they where's just put it that going? In the movie? Why don't they not put it in the movie? Yeah, why not? Dumb question. <clears throat> why not? You know what? What? Let's leave it at that because we. I, I don't, don't want to get we're, into. We're not going to come to a resolution. We're not going to come to a resolution on this. Hey, listen. We, we've got another. Gotta start a resolution. Well, you should start a resolution. Have a resolution for Jeepers Creepers Three. Copyrighted. That's a copyrighted. No, I changed the lyrics so we don't have to pay anything. Okay, we did. <laughs> We're probably gonna have to pay something. Yeah. Uh, Take it out of your paycheck. <laughs> all right. Well, Jeepers Creepers. I would say too. Well, um, so Jeepers Creepers is a scary movie for Halloween time yeah. to get your spooks in. Spook time. Your yeah. Spook it's a spook time. time. Hit it's your spook it's, quota. Yeah. Spook. You get your yeah. you get your, your spooks in with this movie. In. Yeah. And I would say, I would say I would recommend it. Um, very highly for a scary movie mm -hmm. for Halloween time. Oh, yeah. What was your recommendation? I would say that this is the movie to see if you want to get really scared and you want to nuzzle up against a loved one and, uh, you know. Maybe have a girl with you. Maybe she jumps, oh, yeah. grabs your arm. Yeah. Or maybe holds on switch, to you switch roles. It's the, it's the girl watching and the guy jumps into her arms. You know? That's another thing. That yeah. happens, too. Yeah. Yeah. Or it we does got, happen. Or we got, like, a, a transsexual monkey and uh, with um, a, a gay giraffe. Yeah, exactly. And they're together, right? And, because and that's the draft what, goes in. It doesn't matter, right, yeah. who it is. It doesn't matter. That's a very... I don't understand. Um, thank you for asking my opinion. My opinion is... That's nope. 
Well, that's okay. okay to have a different. I think different we knew where opinion. that was going. I don't I have to know. like everything. You don't. You do not. So it's a criticism. It's a criticism. It's a criticism. And that's okay. It's okay to have opinions. It's okay. Even if they're not uh, opinions that are like yours. What's so. up with Parker? Is Parker getting involved? No, I think he's gone. Okay. Parker, Parker, if you're still listening and you're still watching on Facebook Live, um, maybe maybe cool it down, buddy. Could you guys leave Parker alone? Just watch he, it. I love him a lot. You don't have to. If you you don't just, have to. He's a beautiful, beautiful, wonderful man. I'm sure he is. I'm sure he's great. Stop hating on him. Are you guys getting distracted? Let's get back to the okay. topic. Well, I just want to address Parker. I just want to. I want to address uh, who's watching, and uh, you know, I just want to make sure that he's not, you know, flooding the 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 feed oh with God, likes. And no, hearts literally, and nobody's stuff saying like yeah. anything, and I don't think we have any viewers. Okay. okay. Well, here's here's one thing I want to say is that um, earlier we we're getting a lot of hate comments and. That's not cool, guys. That's not just what like, we're about. We're, we're not about. Positivity. We're not about the hate. Yeah, no. just keep it. Keep positivity. it all love. Yeah. Keep it. Keep it one hundred. You guys know that I keep it one hundred like all the time, and I hate hundo, no hundo, hate. Hundo, hundo, and hundo, hundo, hundo. to to all the haters, just keep on hating because it just makes us stronger. Haters okay? will it think this is aff- Photoshop. It doesn't affect us at all. Yeah. I just want to say that too on Facebook Live. This is the first time we did it, and we got tons of hate. Just don't stop with the hate, guys. Stop it. Stop the hate. Give the hits. Yeah. First of all, stop the hate because we won't do the Facebook Live again if you continue the hate. That's what that's that's and that's your punishment. Mm-hmm. That's a punishment for you guys. If Something you do that. you have to deal with later. Yeah, exactly. All with right, your guys. Therapist. Moving on to the next movie. Great. We got another movie coming out. This one, this one I'd say would fall into the category. This one fall into the category of Oscar movie. Oh yeah. Action movie. Oh yeah. Global catastrophe movie. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes, you know what exactly what I'm talking yeah, about, yeah, you guys. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's a movie called Geostorm. I'm oh, so god. excited for this Oh my god, I'm so this excited was for this exhilarating. One. This was oh, the my, gosh, this my yeah. favorite of the three that we watched. Yep. Yeah. Oh. Um, this one's called easy. Geostorm. It comes out October 20th. Mm-hmm. Okay, so it's a little bit ways Halloween. down the line. Not Halloween. Not it's, Not it's Halloween. It's a Halloween time. It's Halloween time, but it's scary in a different way. It's scary in a in a way that like. Everyone could die. Yeah. Not just a few kids in, in Louisiana. Louisiana are running from a creeper. Mm-hmm. Okay? It's not about that. It's about the mm-hmm. whole world's going to die unless someone does something. And this is a Make great a movie. It stars Talitha Eliana. She's our, she's our star. Love. Oh, my God. Yeah. She plays Hannah. Hannah. The beautiful Hannah. Mm-hmm. The beautiful protagonist. Um, up next, we got Gerard Butler as Jake. Oh my God! Okay. Dream. He plays. Boat. A, yeah. Yeah. Um, he plays boat. a weatherman. You guys know that he's my favorite actor of all time, right? He's so oh, good. Oh yeah. my God! Admire. Talk about talk about three hundred. Let's talk about it. Talk about. Oh yeah. Uh, you know, talk oh, about yeah. uh, three hundred Rise of an Empire. Mm-hmm. Talk about uh, the one he was in with uh, Jennifer Aniston. Yeah. Run for the money. Run for the money. Yeah. I mean, the, it's just endless. Seven Money just Down. Like, uh, yeah. yeah. Not to mention his other movies. The one with Harry Connick Jr. Yeah. Take Me Away. P.S. I Love You. Yeah, talk about P.S. Uh-huh. I Love You. Talk 27 about, Dresses. Yeah. That was a good one. Yeah, talking about Monsters, Inc. Monsters University. Talking about Monster, Charlize Theron, talk Christina Ricci. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Same thing. <clears throat> Monsters was, Ball, Billy yeah. Bob Thornton. Yeah. yeah. Oh, man. A lot these of great are such stuff. good movies. I love all of these movies, you guys. <laughs> um, very similar. And then rounding out, the, rounding out the cast, we got Abby Cornish playing mm. Sarah Wilson. Beautiful, beautiful. Old actors. Abby Corn. Acorn. Old Acorn. Acorn. <laughs> it's funny. By the way, get the app, Acorns, because it will uh, invest you some money. It will make you some money down the line. So just yeah. get that. Um, it invests, rounds up every dollar. Yeah, it rounds up every dollar and invests your spare change mm-hmm. into big chunks of change later on in your life. Yeah. Um, we got Ed Harris. Andy Garcia mm. is another great Unsung one. Unsung hero. Oh yeah. my gosh. Yeah. Character actor extraordinaire. Absolutely. So good, yeah. They're all in this. This is a mm-hmm. big This is a big movie, you guys. I feel big like cast. This is a big Geo. Geostorm. Geostorm. This Geostorm. is Storm. one of the big yeah, Read that synopsis, man. Here's the Give synopsis. Me that yeah. Synapse. When, a ca- when catastrophic climate change endangers Earth's very survival, world governments unite to create a Dutch Boy program, a worldwide net of satellites surrounding the planet. 
that are armed with geoengineered technologies designed to stave off natural disasters. Mm. After successfully protecting the planet for two years, something is starting to go wrong. Two estranged brothers are tasked with solving the program's malfunction before a worldwide geostorm can engulf the planet. And that's, see, that's the, uh, Andy Garcia and Gerard Butler play the two estranged brothers. Mm -hmm. Right. That's the heart of the story, you guys. Yeah, that's the most important thing. It's not so much about the geostorm, it's Mm -hmm. about the rift of the The brothers. The storm between the brothers. Oh my gosh, yeah. It's It's a brother storm. It's about that so much, you guys. Um... And one of my favorite scenes, I mean, I don't want to jump in and, and kind of hog Let's it. Let's get into it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't want to hog it. I don't want to hog it. No, you really just have to just like deliver. Yeah. It's just so good. But one of my God, favorites, I love it. one of my favorite scenes is, um, <coughs> I mean, it's just, it's right in the beginning. It's, uh, you know, the geostorm is about to start mm. and Andy Garcia and Gerard Butler have come face to face for the first time in years. Mm-hmm. And they're still in, we, mm-hmm. it's like, you know, the backstory and you're like, how were they going <laughs> to even talk to each other and fix this geostorm? Yeah. They had a real rift between them for oh a my long gosh, time. Because yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, what happened, uh, there was like a, uh, their mother passes away and she is very wealthy and leaves a will that they can't find. So yeah. they're going back and forth about money and so they end up becoming mm-hmm. turns know, out, separated. But, turns, then, out, but, turns out the will is in one of the satellites. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I don't want to give it away, but that's, that's it's, just, then, it's in the trailer. I don't want to give it away, also, but that's not only why they're rift. They're they're in a rift either. It's mm-hmm. not just that. There's some other things we yeah. find out. Even oh, though we're yeah. giving yeah. it away, yeah. we're not giving it away. The satellites but have this a lot to do with it. This scene is like this. This won't give anything away. No, no. no um, no. Do, do you want to let's 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 get ready. Right let's into roll it. it. Yeah. No let's spoilers for this one, guys. No spoils. Hello, brother. How are you, brother? I'm good. How are you, brother? Well, I've been better. I've yeah. been better when I didn't have to deal with the geostorm. Yeah, I've been better too, not having to deal with the geostorm. It kind of sucks, doesn't it? Well, it's based on technology that you built. Well, it's based on your butt being stupid. Because oh, you fucking took my money. Again with this. All the time. Yeah, your butt is dumb. And you got a big one too. It's a fucking big butt. Jake. What? Steve? Jake. The world is going to end if we don't stop this geostorm. And if the world ends, we're never going to find Mom's will. Oh yeah? Maybe I don't care anymore about the will. Maybe I care about destroying this world so that you die well if that's the game then i'm gonna i'm gonna recalibrate these satellites to smash down on the earth and make sure it's centraled right in your vicinity i'm typing right now yeah too bad you don't have the access code you dumb butt damn it that's right you always are stupid error error Computer. Yeah, that's my error computer, man. It says error when you're doing something not right in the computer. God damn it, Jake. I programmed that myself because I'm a genius. Well, you know, you forget. I'm also a genius. Yeah, no, you're never, you're, you were never as a genius as I was. Computer. Computer. Present. Computer, recalibrate to find the two prime numbers to unlock the passage code to the gigabyte drive. Yeah, too bad I programmed it so when you asked that, it would say error. 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 Damn it. Error. Error. Too good, Jake. Yeah, I- I'm too good. And you know what's really good? Is that all the teddy bears that mom had were supposed to be mine. And that you fucking stole them from me. Her beanie baby collection? Yeah. I don't even know the names. You fucking know the names boys? better than I do. Boys? Boys? Who's that? I, boys? Coming through the satellite. That's not, that's not my computer. Jake? Steve? Steve. My name's Steve. Yeah, Mom? Is that Who are you Steve talking Jake? to? Who are you talking to? Is that Mom? I can't hear you. I'm in a... Stupid... 
her. I think I know what she said. Boys, Steve. you have to come get. She said she's getting stupider. No. Jupiter. She's Hello? in Jupiter. Hello, Jupiter. We have to we, figure uh, out if uh, she's in Jupiter or if she is error. Jupiter. Error. Error. Well, here back on the news, the weather report is that the, the hurricanes are everywhere and there's tornadoes in the sky. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Steve. And back to me. All right, so uh, we had an interesting development about the geostorm today. Apparently two brothers are in cahoots about what to do about the geostorm. One said he created it and one is trying to fix it. <laughs> what a crazy set of dudes are that are going doing that stuff. <laughs> back to the weather. Well, uh, an update on that story is that um, they have recently just heard the voice of their mom in uh, one of the satellites, and she said she is in Jupiter. So uh, oh. <laughs> they're currently trying to figure out how to get her out of Jupiter. Oh, what a bunch of wacky things they're saying. That's crazy. Well, everyone <laughs> will die if they don't fix this. <laughs> Uh-oh, hey, hey, maybe you won't get to see my wife then. Hey! <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll really miss my kids. <laughs> <clears throat> Wow, I love the news scene too. That really was good. Well, I mean, that gives you an idea of exactly. what the world the is seeing. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's yeah. the stakes yeah. of it. Yeah. yeah, and I think every global stakes. catastrophe, every global catastrophe needs that. They yeah. do. You know, they need stakes. You need to know what else is going on in the world because I mean, yeah. you see the point of view from like the scientists and the brothers and yeah, like, yeah, the yeah. mom would have, but like you have to know what the people are. It saying. doesn't really hit home until you know what what's hearing. going on. Yeah. Yeah. Did you guys ever, ever see Interstellar? Yes. Um, yeah, not my favorite, but yeah, it, it was okay. okay. I mean, yeah. Cool. I was just wondering. Well, um, so this movie don't give me really don't get me good, started though. with Christopher Christopher Nolan. Okay. Don't Christopher get me started. Dolan. Don't get me started. Christopher, Christopher. Duh. Yeah, more Christopher Boring. Christopher. Boring. 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 Yeah. Hey, don't you guys boring. don't have to just say it just because I'm saying it. I'm sorry. I'm just, just like. I mean, I, I, I don't think. I don't, think, don't I, agree I with me a, just to agree with me. About I think he's a hack. I think he's a hack. I don't agree with you. I, don't, I think he sucks. I'm not doing it. Well, okay. But, but yeah. I, I just, can I just say that, like, I, I, I really like the, you, he brings you back to the brotherly arguing, you know, like yeah. like the, the bad insults, you know, like Gerard yeah. Butler just really nails him with oh, some insults. Man. It really yeah. is. The way the writing is, it's really a like a ballet of back mm -hmm. and forth. I mean, the way that he talks about his butt, mm -hmm. that his buttocks being large, yeah, yeah, I yeah. think yeah. is valuable yeah. to how they view each other in oh, the relationship. Yeah. It really is, yeah. 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 I, I want to go to a scene where, um, you know, Andy Garcia's trying to work this out, and then Gerard Butler's just really nailing him with some, with some, with some. With He's some got some real singers. singers. Yeah. yeah. Zinger he had, singers. He, he brought some hitters. Let's just yeah. say that, yeah. And this is, this is the part where they both know, like, they're living in a studio apartment together. Mm -hmm. They've already spent a lot of time together. This is the part where they, you know, have to make a decision. The next few steps that they take are going to end the world or save the world yeah. oh yeah yeah yeah. high stakes high stakes stakes high stakes about stakes. lots of a1 sauce <laughs> <laughs> let's see that okay all right hey steve what is it jake i can't understand how you got through the door with your butt being so fucking big this is oh, a knife yeah How'd you, did you save it in your butt? When you got here, you put it in your butt? As soon as this is over, I'm gonna slice your neck open. Yeah, well, it's already over because you can't crack into the computer codes because I made it, so you can't do it yet. God oh. damn it. Yeah, that's right. <sighs> Wait a second. Satellites. The satellites can bounce the code back to my original computer and then back onto the memory card. If I reverse it, that will be the code. Wait. I think I just figured it out. The passcode is... Wait, hold on one second. I'm getting a call. I'm getting a call. It's the doctor. Oh, hello, doctor? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay, thank you. Okay, I'll let him know. What did he say? Uh, that was the doctor. He said your butt is fucking huge. God damn it. He diagnosed you with fucking having a big butt and you're gonna die. I fucking... Ring, 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 ring. Hello? Ring. Hi, 
This is Frost Nixon from the local weather station, and I'm hey, calling Frost. to. Hi, um, I'm. I was sent out into the atmosphere with a geostorm, <coughs> and I'm really having a hard time finding my way back. I just, I'm really all alone out here, and, and all my colleagues died, and, and, and I just don't know what to do. And I'm trying to be really brave, and I just, I don't know get out, how to get out of this okay, geostorm. Hey, I'll save you. I'll ah, save you. Uh, okay. Hey, hey. What? Hey, Frost. Yeah. You need to be quiet right now and listen to me. Okay. Who is it? I'll let you. You shut your fucking mouth, you big ass freak. I'll tell you right Does now. Does someone there have a big ass? That's, and, and that's what I need you to do. And if the only way this is going to work, if you do something for me, okay? Yeah. What did she I'll say about you. my ass? I need you to... Why don't you go? Why don't you go away? Hold on. I gotta walk in this. I'm going to the other room. Okay. Bros. Are you still there? I'm here. It's this is the I just dialed a set alone. of random numbers and you were the only one that picked up. I'm all alone. You got the right person. Really, that's crazy. I need you to tell my brother what that he has the biggest butt in the fucking world Shh. and that you'll, no one will ever love him. How is that gonna get me out of the jail? Just store? do it, please. It's just something I want. Okay. <laughs> all right. What's his name? All right, his name is Steve. Okay. Okay. Here's the phone. Hey, Steve. Got someone uh, I'll talk to you. It's about the geostorm. Who it's is a it? reporter that's out in the in in space. Oh, she can give us some some access to. Steve, hello. To, to the hello, Steve. Yes. Is this Steve? Yes, this is Steve. How can how? how I really what, need help. Yes, we'll help you. Just let us know where you I are. I don't know how to get back to Earth because there's a big obstacle in the way. <laughs> like a big okay. big obstacle. Hey, hey, what is it? You can Steve? get it out of the way. I, I'm in control of the satellites. Well, I think it's. Your butt! I can't get it, I can't see Earth because there's a big butt in the way. Hey, thank you, that's great. That was, was that really, okay? you like was improvised that on that one. That was good. Yeah, I didn't even no. tell you to say it like that. I just had something in my back pocket it's, and it just felt right. Hey, Steve, I, I don't think we can help her. Maybe your butt is fucking help. in the way. Help, help, there's something coming out. Oh, yeah. Hello, hello, is anybody still there? I just killed him. I just killed my brother. What do you mean? I just killed him. He's dead. It's gonna be okay. We'll get you through this. He wouldn't. Talk to me. Talk to me. Is this the guy with the big butt again? Shut up. God damn it. Why do you have such a big butt? I don't. It's a regular sized butt. I heard it's huge. It's, it's enormous. Oh, you're alive. Jake. <laughs> yeah? I'm sorry I did that, Jake. I'm so sorry. It's okay. We're brothers. We fight. We fight. And we, we, get, we don't get along, and sometimes that's just the way it is. You're right. I thought you always hated me, but... I don't. I love you. I love you so much. Wait, the passcode, it's finally its finally coming in. Let me read it. Hold on. Number one, L-O-V-S-T-3-V-3. I love Steve. That's your passcode? Yeah. It's not done. Keep reading it. Here, I'll read it out for you. More letters popping up. Um, Steve Ansign E H one money sign B U T T money sign U C K X. Hey, Chris. Is anybody there? Is anybody uh, there? I just have to tell you one thing. I have to tell you one thing. What? It's not a money sign. It's called a dollar sign. I just had to. I just had to put that out there before I get sucked into the vacuum that is space. I never. I never knew that. <laughs> Thank you for telling me that. Thank you. Oh, guys, one more thing. One more thing before I get sucked into the vacuum of outer space. It's not the and sign. It's the ampersand. No, I just typed in the password. I could have saved her. I know. I lied about everything. I never knew how to save her. Hey, I just wanted to, you to be around me so we could just, you know, joke around for old time's sake. I think we did that. Yeah. I think we did. I'm dying though, and you killed me. And it's going to be on your conscience. The whole world's dying. She, yeah, 
I did that. I feel really bad now. We both did bad things. I wonder if we'll ever be able to... Computer. Boys. Oh, mother again. Sons. Yeah, yeah mom. <laughs> Is she farting? Is she doing a fire? Hey, you guys, it's me, your mother. It's me. Mom. Yeah. Big butt. <laughs> oh, she got you good, Steve. You got, boys, wait, boys. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yeah, so I can hear you, Mom. Oh, God, I finally got through. I'm somewhere that I'll never be able to see you again, but I want you to know that I love you both equally, and I feel everything you're feeling, like an E.T. sort of thing, but you guys, this was meant to be. You had to be together. You had to go through this to know that you're all each other has. I think I know that now. (laughs) Shh. Shh. I think I know that now, Jake. Yeah, I think. I, I can't even think straight. I've lost a lot of blood. I think this whole geostorm was just a... was just something that had to happen to bring us together. It really did, didn't it? It had to happen. It had to happen. Sorry the world can't be saved, but at least we'll die knowing that we're brothers till the end. Eh, uh, look, the news is on. Uh, yeah, it's in breaking news. Report reporting that about the weather is me, Tom. And the weather is that the geostorms have stopped. Hey, Tom, why did the geostorms stop? Well, turns out that uh, someone uh, someone with a very big butt sat on a computer <laughs> and typed in the right code, and the satellites all fell into space. And it's believed that his butt, being the size that it was, was the key factor that created that created the thing that stopped the geostorm. So we are forever grateful to his butt. <laughs> I'm forever grateful to his butt, but uh, I guess I'm not grateful that I'll have to see my wife again tonight, am I right? <laughs> or my kids. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Let's take it to Caitlin in sports. Hey guys, it's me, Caitlin. My husband, Melvin, was a scientist on the Geostorm Space X-12, and he's uh, gone, so I I don't really... Well, she's being a real bummer right now. Happening. All right, Caitlin, let's reel I, it in here. Okay, all right, Caitlin. No more of that depressing I, stuff. Right. The world saved, so... Yeah. No, I haven't Okay, all right, Caitlin. Caitlin, take it. Let's stop it here. Caitlin, take it personal day. Caitlin, Caitlin needs to leave. Okay, everyone. Okay, Caitlin's having having a good time. All right, so hey, well, just the sports, uh, the the team won. The the Jaguars took hey. it all. Hey, didn't the, they? the world won today. <laughs> the world won. The world won. That's right. That's right. Some people had to die, and, uh, and it's okay. Happens, and that's yeah. that's what happens sometimes. And apparently, the story of the brothers really nice, heartfelt silver lining. Oh my gosh! They so had great. they came together, and you know what? They they had to have this had to happen. Sometimes tragedy has to happen for to two bring people to come two together. People isn't that true? Together, yes. Yes. And this is the most we've ever talked in the show, isn't it? I think so. Tom, sometimes you're just talking about climates, and I don't even know what you're talking about. And, and I feel you're like just now... running your fucking mouth about nothing all the time. Just you should. Stuff. You really should go fuck yourself. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> well, I'll go fuck your mom, your wife. <laughs> well, please do. I don't want her. <laughs> hey, I'll fuck your kids. I just love the camaraderie between, like, oh, though yeah. uh, uh, the Anchorman should have their own spinoff. Movie. Well, here's what it, here's you know? here's what I think the They're filmmaker so was hilarious. doing is like. It's like pairs of people. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. And the yeah. pairs mm-hmm. are finding each other. Oh, yeah. Throughout the geostorm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, and yeah. they're paired off and they're finding yeah. they're they're not so different. I, oh, yeah. It really is. And, and you know, I, it's it's a little weird and unorthodox, but the, at the end, Caitlin, the, the sports lady, has yeah. her little spinoff. Uh-huh. Yeah. Tale, oh, right? Yeah. Which is great. And she, it's really weird. Yeah. Yeah. It's a very short, but we can yeah. play it right yeah, now. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Hi, Caitlin. How you doing? I heard you talk about sports and football on the TV sometimes. Baseball, football, water oh. polo, horse polo, regular polo, polo acrobat, acrobatic aerial space, some kind of spaceman, astronauts, ass jeans, 
Gene Wilder, say, Wild Wild West. Say, say, I love when you talk about all these sports things. You know, where I thought you was just a city pretty gal talking about your makeup. <laughs> But you, you and I don't have nothing. You have something in common with me, and I like that. It's my favorite. Basketball. Oh boy. Turkey butterball turkey. Wow, that was that was a weird, weird ending. But you know what? Her spinoff is avant garde. Very weird. Very, yeah, very yeah, weird. yeah, yeah. It's like um, it's just like. Oh, she was just like, I want to talk about the things that I like, but it just turned yeah. into this really fucking weird stream. Of yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's weird because in in the the format of didn't the, even of air the, of the Never duo, aired. yeah, it didn't. I mean, this is something that was off. I mean, it was in the it was credits, a deleted scene yeah. kind of thing. Yeah, okay, some of it in the credits, and then they yeah. yeah. But but they stuck with the theme of the duo, right? Everyone, it's Everyone always got in paired tubes. off. Yeah, yeah. Who was that off. other guy again that was with her? He was just well. You I don't see remember him, seeing him in he's, Geostorm. He's in the first scene of Geostorm, and he's like a farmer, his and he's like his name's Pellet. Pellet. His name's yeah. Pellet. Yeah, he's driving oh, yeah. a tractor, oh, and he's Pellet. the first one who sees it. He sees the Geostorm, and yeah. he, he like looks up, and the camera pans. Can we up see with that him. really quickly? Yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. What are all them clowns doing to me? Oh, that was really yeah. good. Wow. Yeah, I, yeah. Okay, I, I I didn't remember until I saw it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wait, what was the next thing he said again? Can we just see that? Oh, yeah. Uh, after the, the storm. Yeah. I got an itch. I got a scratch. That's yeah. kind of but a then, non sequitur, but, is, but yeah. But then yeah, right yeah. after that, uh -huh. he has a TV on his, his tractor. He turns mm -hmm. it on. Guess who he sees? Caitlin. Oh, he's up. He's painting the sports, but he's talking about my team. Yeah, you know, yeah. <laughs> I really, it comes full the, circle. I really love You love the really, New Hampshire I love, birds. I love yeah. the New Hampshire birds. I love the Gene Wilder. Like, like he is not. The New Hampshire. He's not smart, right? Yeah, yeah. He's I, not feel that, I feel that to get right. any understanding of it, it's that she's just naming off things that could be sports. And that he's just like. I, he's just so enthralled yeah. by it. You know, I can't even do his voice. I, I get this is like I said, the knock out, knock out of the park. This one, if it doesn't get an Oscar nod, at least I'm just this gonna is, be I'm gonna be through I mean, with movies. You know, sitting yeah. in that theater seat because yeah. I I refuse to just you know sit and watch yeah. it on my computer. Like I want to go to the movies and mm -hmm. have that experience. Oh yes. yeah, um, absolutely. I like I, sitting in that seat. I'm like I'm having a good time. I'm having yeah. fun. Mm -hmm. I'm laughing. I'm excited. I'm shocked. I, I'm, I'm just scared. so involved. I'm, I'm mm -hmm. scared. I'm mm -hmm. spooked. I'm not spooked. It's just I. I was there for the ride. I was along for the ride. Totally, yeah, totally, so totally, much, totally. so much. Yeah. I, I. I gotta say, guys, I really love this movie. I do too. I just. I. I want to watch it again. Yeah. I have the. You know. I have the. We, uh, we got the screeners. Movie. Yeah. We got I the got screeners. screeners. We do. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Those are great. Um, I'm glad we did that. The fall movie preview. Did, Eric, did it? Did it exceed your expectations? Oh, so much so. Yeah, so much so. And we still got we got the winter movies coming up too. Oh yeah, we do. Which is the Christmas stuff, and that yeah. we're gonna save that yeah. for Christmas time. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh god, I love the holiday movies. Mm -hmm. Anything Sarah ja, Sarah Ja Parker is in, I am all about it. Well, I don't know if Parker. she's in Sarah Ja Parker. I, yeah. I don't know if she's in a Christmas movie this year, but I. I I hope to God she is. Dude, if she's just fingers. like hope in like a bundle of family yeah. and it just and she is the odd woman out. She like is. that's classic fish out of water story. I wanna see her struggle and then I wanna see a resolution. And I wanna see Christmas event. Day yeah, everything resolved. I do. Yeah. I wanna see that. See. I wanna see, I wanna see, see people, everyone yeah. Yeah, people people Christmas lights. People, you know, in the beginning. Holiday lights for the non denominational yeah. folk people, out there. Right. Flawed people changing over Christmas. Oh, mm -hmm. That's what I want to see. Yeah, that's the only time I ever feel like I can transform into a different person is over Christmas. Absolutely, exactly. yeah, absolutely. The rest so of the much. year, I am a dick. Mm -hmm. But you know that like week, week yeah. and a half There's right before about Christmas? Christmas time. There's something about something about that Tannenbaum, you know? Yeah, that oh, Christmas tree. Yeah. Oh, I'm, all right, all, I'm all about the Tannenbaum. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You like the Tannenbaum? I like the Tannenbaum. The Wassail. Tannenbaum. I like the Pan and Tom. Tannenbaum. Pan and Tom. All right, guys. So verdict on Geostorm. We gave it, man. God. Thumbs up all the I way. Mean, did you hear six, a passion? Six leather books. Six leather books. That's what I give it. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with 15 and a half tubs of popcorn. Whoa. Yeah. yeah. That's the highest. That's one of the highest ratings I've ever given. I think I did highest one. I'm gonna go with buying one, owning one J Crew franchise. 
in Santa yeah. Monica. Jeez, wow. that that's what I'm talking about. That's that's a, that's a purchase that's that a keeps making money. That's a purchase that makes you money. Oh, yeah. yeah, it's the gift that keeps about. on giving. It's a gift, yeah. and isn't that what Christmas is all about? It's really about sure Christmas. Is. Yeah. So come back on. Come back to the movie vault on Christmas. <clears throat> Christmas time and beer is good to me.